Hi, I'm Christelle and welcome to this evening's edition of E Prime. Veteran entertainer Sizzla Kalanje is back with a brand new album titled Fought For This. The album produced on the Alta Fan Records label features 10 tracks including unreleased singles as well as titles already out for the public, including the combination Don't Worry, which features Gentleman and Mark Wanda. The album also features American rapper M1, Capleton and Version, to name a few. It will be officially released on June 16 and will be available in digital version as well as on CD and vinyl. Dancehall artist Popcorn is again teaming up with Mix Pack Records for another album. The duo has been working relentlessly over the last few weeks on the project, which is due early next year. Dre Skull is currently in Jamaica and shared this photo on Instagram with the caption, Haven't slept yet, but the vibes still connect. Popcorn and Dre Skull have worked on previous projects, including the System single on the Loudspeaker Rhythm. The unruly DJ gears up for his UK tour after his feature earlier this year on Drake's Boy Meets World tour. The cannabis buzz continues and here to tell us more about the Canex Jamaica Cannabis Seminar is Douglas Gordon. Canex is essentially an event platform that will bring together different stakeholders from the cannabis industry. We have a number of international um, stakeholders coming in as well as government policymakers people in the business, farmers, um, all different aspects represented. And essentially what we're trying to do is just play a, play a productive role in moving the conversation forward. Jamaica can establish its industry fully and um, take its place in the global landscape. We have a number of international guests who have come in to, to be with us. Special guest Jim McMahon, who's an NFL great, the Chicago Bears back in the 80s. I'm here at Canex to uh extend my experiences uh, with cannabis and with the other drugs that I was forced to take over my career. Uh, I've gotten rid of all the other painkillers that I've been on over the years and uh, cannabis is, is something that I've, I've not only enjoyed but it makes my body feel better, makes me feel better and there's no side effects that I had with the, uh, the prescription drug. Whether you're an educator, whether you're a, research, a researcher, whether you're a business person or an investor, whether you're a farmer, um, there's so different opportunities across all the verticals in the industry that anyone who has a serious interest in the cannabis industry and how they can play a role I think should come out to Canex on Friday May 5th at the Jamaica Pegasus. It starts at 9 o'clock in the morning and it goes until uh, 6 30 in the evening. On the international scene, Jamaican dancer Brokop has now turned his attention to a career in the recording industry and is reaping mainstream success, having made appearances at the recently staged BET Awards and the iHeart Music Festival. Brokop will share the stage this weekend with international hip-hop star Rick Ross in North Carolina as he continues to strengthen his brand. And that's it for this evening's edition of E-Prime. I'm Christelle. Thank you for watching.